I just thought he was the one. But Susie, you found him in bed with your therapist. I know. I just thought she was maybe helping him out with some behavioral therapy. What? Yeah, I'm just not sure about your face. My face? Just in that last part. Well, you're supposed to feed me the next line. I, I really just think you need a little less Crocodile Dundee. I just spent the morning with my American dialect coach. <laughs> no, your accent is great. It's really just your face. Maybe, maybe try to be a little less brunette. Oh, you mean more like peaches and cream? Yeah. And let me guess, red hair would be better too? I, I feel it would be a better fit for the character description. You mean if I was more like you? I'm just trying to help you be authentic to the character's motivation. And remind me, what was the last role that you booked? We both know it was Grey's Anatomy. I was on set just last week, remember? Yeah. What was the crucial part that you played? Even though I technically didn't have any dialogue, I was integral to the inner workings of that scene. Hmm. This isn't even about me. No, you're right. It's about me. Listening to you. Telling me what you think should or should not be done with a person's face. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to help you not do that thing you were doing with your eyebrows. What frown? Like a human being? Yes. You know it's not natural for a person's face to be paralyzed for three months at a time. Botox is practically organic. Yeah, the organic process of injecting toxins into your eyes and mouth. Yes. <sighs>